Sorry, you guys, I got a phone call that interrupted this video, but it is all right, I'm back. Another thing, us black women, we need to learn how to love and to appreciate ourselves. We cannot be out here trying to be like the Instagram models, trying to be like this and then the third, because guess what? I've changed my hair. I've started putting extra stuff on my face as well as within my soul, and nothing has changed. New people and the same people still like me. They're still interested in me. They still want to know what is what. I'm telling you, nothing is going to change. If anything, me wearing my hair like this or me having my hair as in dreads or whatever, if you do certain things in your life, it'll keep out the wrong people. You know what I mean? Because they won't even have a means to approach you the wrong way. I'm 20... Five years old. I had to think about that because I'm thinking about something else. <laughs> I'm 25 years old. Just turned 25 in August. I am a Leo. So we are the queens and kings of this jungle. We have to set an example. We need to set a tone out there. And I'm talking about everybody, not just us Leos. You too as well that is watching this video. You guys, we have got to change the dynamic for this world. Um... Our hair is beautiful. Us black people, us Indian people, us white people, us Mexican people, us Puerto Rican, Asian, Chinese, all of us. We are all beautiful in our own light. We don't need all the extra shit. Ain't nothing wrong with getting dressed up. Ain't nothing wrong with wearing makeup because I do wear it. I do on an occasion. But you can't get wrapped up in the hype, I'm telling you, because that's all a part of mainstream media, a way to get your moolah. So I'm very happy and very excited to be coming to you guys to share with you guys my dreadlock journey. I really hope everything just grows well. I really hope everything just goes well because I I'm just really excited for my future and to see how this journey is going to go in my life. And I'm so glad that I am better in tuned with myself and who I am. And no one can tell me about me, my relationship with God, my relationship with the universe, and my relationship with my spirit guides, my ancestors. You cannot tell me about my journey. God has already known my journey. So no one in this planet can tell you about you but you, okay? So um, just stay strong if you are starting dreads. Um, don't let people try to change or, or try to tell you necessarily how what is supposed to be. You are going to go through these stages that are going to be hard. But if you continue to pray and meditate... You will push through. There are harder days to come. People have to understand that, okay? I really hope you guys start dreads, or if you haven't start dreads, please look into the spiritual meaning behind dreads. Please do deep research for dreads. I am telling you, you will want to start the journey. You will want to go that spiritual path because it is the right way. It's the way we're supposed to do. Our African culture was stripped from us and placed in a control culture because they wanted to have control and fear over us. They wanted us to live in fear and in control because that is the way you control society. That's why you guys need to break away from that. I am around a lot of people each and every day. And I'm just like, if I had the time to tell you my life story, I would. And I bet you it would change your mind about everything you believe in. Um, but I will be doing story time videos coming up soon. So I hope everyone is ready. I hope, I hope y'all ready for these story times because I'm going to start from the beginning to now. So like and subscribe. I hope you enjoyed this video. Follow me on everything at Kita Kins, K-E-N-Z underscore 94. Thank you so much for watching and have a great day.